Chef John Sharp of the Turquoise Room at the La Posada in Winslow does most of his shopping at the Flagstaff Farmer's Market, and he is a regular buyer of Irene Benali's lambs. Today he shows us how to prepare some special dishes using the churro lamb. What I have here is a leg of churro lamb, and if you look at it very carefully, you will see that you can actually see the meat right through the skin cover. There's no fat cover on this lamb. These are free-range grazed lambs. What I have here is a number of cuts of lamb and some pork, which are gonna go into our churro lamb pozole. This is Navajo pit roasted corn. And if you look at the cooked one here, you will see that that is your traditional hominy. Right here, what I have is some diced lamb. I have some pieces of pork. And then these cuts here, also very interesting and worth looking at carefully. These are the cuts from the neck of lamb. And again, this is uh, extremely lean for neck pieces. So we'll put that into the pot. The next thing this dish will get is a whole array of foods. Gets the tomatoes, gets the onions, and the peppers. And then we have a whole array of dried spices here. Oregano, marjoram, cumin, coriander, a little bay leaf. All of that gets put in. It's a very simple dish to do. Fresh garlic, can't forget the fresh garlic. We just throw a little bit of that in there. And then over here, I have a selection of dried chilies. We have chili negro, we have Oaxaca chili, and then we have the Guajillo chili. All of these get roasted or toasted and then put into the pozole. So what we're going to do now is we're going to just simply cover this with water and start simmering it until the lamb is tender. What we're now going to do is start assembling a dish that I call the Navajo Churro Lamb Sampler. The dish comprises of three different dishes. One which is the uh, churro lamb pozole. Uh, the second one, which I'm about to start right now, is the lamb chop. And I'm gonna cut a couple of lamb chops off here that we're going to be grilling. These we'll serve very simply on a bed of fresh arugula with a pico de gallo salsa. And then we're gonna put this whole dish together. So we're now gonna do the green chili tamale. Take a couple of scoops of our sweet corn tamale. We're then gonna top it with a little churro lamb green chili. This is generally taken from the shoulder cut, which we braise very slowly with cilantro, green chilies, and tomatillos. The last element of the dish, a little fresh arugula as a base. Then we're gonna take these two beautiful chops that we grilled. We're gonna put those on top. I'm gonna do a little crema fresca on the tamale. Just a little stripe of that. We're gonna take a little bit of corn salsa, sprinkle it with a little corn salsa, just to give it a little bit of a crunch. Then we're gonna take the pico de gallo, and that's gonna go on top of the lamb chops like that. And then a little bit of cilantro for garnish. Just a little bit more green. Take that like that. Put that over here. And that is our Navajo churro lamb sampler. Three dishes, pozole with red chili, grilled churro lamb chops on arugula with a pico de gallo salsa that has fresh sage and mint in it, and a green chili sweet corn tamale.